Hi guys, welcome to our abs workout today. We're gonna to be using the slider discs and the Pilates ball. If you don't have the sliders, you can use some dishcloths or some tea towels on the floor. Just fold them up and pop them underneath your feet. All right, so if you are pregnant, I just wanna make sure that you are not in this one today. This one is not for you. I'm very sorry, we're gonna be doing too many abs. Go and join another workout. All right, are we ready? We're gonna start with that ball and we're gonna place our disc right at the end of the mat. So we're gonna get straight into it today. We'll start with a tiny little stretch at the beginning, but then we're gonna get into that ab burn. All right, so let's come down onto the mat and you wanna make sure that your butt is right at the end. So you don't wanna be in the center of your mat. I folded mine so it's half, just because you don't need the full one today, you just need half and you wanna have your butt right at the edge. All right, so we're gonna place that ball in between our shoulder blades. So right where your bra strap would sit and just the heels in the center of the disc. We're just gonna take a nice little stretch to start off. So let's just open the arms into cactus and we're just gonna lay over that ball. So just get into that comfortable position. It should be quite comfortable underneath your head as well. So you shouldn't be feeling any pain in your neck. Just move it around until you find that position where you can lay over the ball Knees are bent, feet to the floor. That's it, arms into 90 degrees. And see if you can get those elbows and wrists down to the floor for me. That's it, let's take some nice deep breaths in here. And out. Two more, big breath in. And out. Last one, big breath in through the nose. Out through the mouth. All right, we're gonna get into it now. Let's take those hands behind our head. Link your fingers together and cradle your head in your hands. Elbows are nice and wide. Let's take a nice deep breath in. As we exhale, we're gonna draw our ribs towards our hips and we're gonna curl up, scooping that tummy. Look towards the belly button. Elbows stay nice and wide. Inhale over that ball. Exhale, we curl. So really think about using the abs to draw you up. So trying to press your head into your hands so you don't lead with your neck and chin. And that eye gaze is going to come with you, it's going to tuck the chin in and we're going to look towards that belly button. Now using that ball really takes any work out of the back here and it really targets those upper abdominals a lot faster than when we're just down on the floor. You can do this one without the ball as well if it's a little too much or if you don't have one. Good, we're going to go for eight more like this then we're going to hold that curl. That's it, last seven, use that exhale, breathing out through pursed lips as we curl up, just like we used to do um, as we blew out birthday candles. Good, almost there. Let's go for four. Last three. Four, two. Last one, we're gonna hold it up. That's it. All right, from here, we're gonna to start to add in our disc. So I want you to go out with the legs, bring them in, curl over the ball. Curl up, out with the legs, in, curl over the ball. Maybe going only maybe three quarters of the way over that ball, so not all the way. We're gonna make it a little harder now. So we wanna keep the heels on the disc. That will help you to slide. Ooh, we should be starting to feel those abs now. Keep the elbows nice and wide. Mine are starting to shake already. Good, we're gonna go for eight more like this and we'll hold that curl. Good, so this is why we have to have our butt sitting at the edge so we can take those legs all the way out and in. Oh my God, my abs are really starting to burn already. We're not even halfway there. Good, last four. Really draw those ribs towards the hips as you curl up for three. Last two. Ooh. All right, last one, let's hold that curl. Now we're gonna go single leg. We're gonna extend the right leg as we lower the body down over the ball. Exhale, curl it in, curl up over the ball. Exhale, we curl up. In, how we come down. So we're alternating legs here. So one goes out and then we curl back up. So we bring the leg in. So it's the same time, we're using lower and upper abdominals here, trying to keep the pelvis really nice and stable. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna walk out of here with a six pack. Let's go for six, for five. Almost there, you've got four, 
Stay with it for three. Draw that belly button down. You've got two. All right, last one. Just the right leg now. So extend, bend. We're going to make it a little bit more spicy in a minute. If this is enough for you, stay here. We've got four, three, two. All right, last one. Hold that curl. From here, lift up your left leg. Now, this is going to get a little tricky, so really pay attention. We're going to extend that right leg, draw the left knee in. As we bring the right knee in, we rotate, we extend that left leg, bring it back to center, bring that left knee in, rotate, extend that leg. Woo! So now we're getting into those obliques here. So let's sink rib to opposite hip, keep the elbows nice and wide. Oh my God, that leg doesn't have to touch the floor and you can always keep that left foot down. If it's too much here, we're gonna go for eight and we're gonna hold it and pulse in seven. Oh my God, for six, my belly is burning. Let's go for five, for four. You're almost there for three, for two. We're gonna hold it. Last one, hold it. Hold that rotation, little tiny pulses. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh my God, take it down. Oh, way over that ball, just have a little stretch. Now, obviously you're aware that we didn't do the other side. So yes, we're gonna be doing it again, just with the left leg. Let's take a nice big breath in, big breath out. One more deep breath in and out. All right, so round two, let's take the hands behind the head, heels in the center of the discs. So we're just gonna start with that ab curl, okay? So let's just go over that ball. Make sure your ball hasn't moved. If it has, you might need to jiggle it around, get into that right position. And we're gonna feel those abs here. We're really gonna feel that burn. Oh, my abs are gonna be so sore tomorrow. Let's keep it up. Good, use that breath. Maybe going only halfway over the ball now. Let's make it a little harder. We're gonna go for eight, for seven. We're gonna let, add those double legs in in a moment. We've got six. Keep the elbows wide, chin tucked in. For five. <laughs> We've got four. Four, three. Four, two. Draw those ribs towards the hips. All right, last one. Hold it. Let's extend the legs out. Bring it in. One curl. Curl it up. Out. In. Curl. Good. Let's go for six. Oh my God. We've got five. Your abs should be on absolute fire. See that joke? Abs on absolute fire. <laughs> I think I'm the only one laughing, obviously. <laughs> Let's go for three. Four, two, you're almost there. Oh my God, last one. All right, from here, we're gonna do that alternating leg. So we extend the left leg, go over the ball, curl it in, change legs, right leg. We'll go over the ball, extend the leg out. So we're using lower abs and upper abdominals at the same time. Oh my God, my abs are shaking. Let's go for eight, for seven. Then we're just gonna do the left leg in six, for five. Keep your hips really nice and stable, no wobbling. You've got three, tuck that chin in. For two, last one. All right, let's just do the left leg for eight. For seven, you're almost done. I promise you've got six, four, five. Ooh, we've got four. For three, stay with me. For two. All right, last one, you're gonna hold it. All right, so from here, this is where we get a little spicy. We're gonna lift up that right leg. We're gonna extend it as we bring that knee in. We're gonna rotate. Then we extend the leg, come back to center. Right leg comes into tabletop. Rotate, bring it in, come back to center, extend. Good, that's it, keep those elbows wide, thinking ribbed opposite hip. Woo, draw that belly button down. My abs are getting such a workout, let's go for eight. And we're gonna hold it, we're almost done, stay with me. For six, for five, oh my God. For four, you're almost there. For three, for two. All right, you're ready to hold it. Little tiny pulses, let's go for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh my God. Oh, 
lay over that ball. Woo! Let's just have a nice stretch. All right, let's take a nice deep breath in and out. Big breath in and out. All right, from here, prop yourself up into your elbows. We're going to come all the way up. Woo! Those abs should be on fire. All right, from here, pop your ball to the side. We are done with that. We're going to finish with a little plank series. Now, this one is nice and spicy. We're really going to get into the obliques and into that booty as well. So we're going to get full body workout here. All right, so what I want you to do is have your disc. And you're going to come to the end of your mat. I'm going to come about three quarters of the way just so I'm not out of the shot. You can go, you can be halfway, that's fine, but you don't want to be all the way up the top of your mat. We need a bit of space for the legs down the bottom. All right, so let's set up into our high plank. Now we want to make sure that we've got shoulders over wrists, little bend in the elbows, and we're drawing the shoulders away from the ears. So you don't want to be like this, we want to draw those shoulders back. Now I'll explain what we're going to do, and we're going to be in that high plank with the disc. It's going to be a tricky one, so stay with me. We're going to start with 10 Spider Man on the right. Keeping that nice controlled position, drawing that knee up towards the outside of the elbow. Then we've got 10 in and outs together. Make sure you don't go too wide. You want to keep it small here. Then we're going to go to the left. So 10 Spider-Man on the left. You've got 10 in and outs. We'll have a little pride, a little breather. We come back down. We're going to switch it. We're going to do 10 right in that toe tap. And then we're going to go into alternating Spider-Man. 10 on the left. And then alternating again. Okay. All right. I'll be ready. I feel like I've already done the whole thing. Okay, so let's come over. Shoulders over wrists. We're starting with the right leg Spider-Man for 10. Let's do it. 10, 9. Keep breathing. Eye gaze in front of the hands. Do not watch your feet. Woo! That's it. Let's go for 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. In and out for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two, one, left leg, let's go, Spider-Man for 10, nine, eight, keep that belly button drawing in, make sure the hips aren't dropping, we've got five, four, three, two, one, in and out for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, don't watch the feet, four, three, two, one, okay, I will allow a rest on the knees, Woo. Just because I need one as well. <laughs> we're only human. All right, give those wrists a little roll. Roll it out the other way. Okay, so now we're going to kind of reverse it and we're going to do 10 in and out, single in and out on the right, then alternating Spider Man, then we've got 10 in and outs on the left, alternating Spider Man, and then you are done. And that is it. All right, we ready? Let's go up into that high plank. 10 in and outs on the right, we've got 10, 9, 8. So we're not alternating just the right leg. We've got 5, 4, Three, two, one, alternating Spider-Man. Let's go. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Keep those hips up. Don't dip through the lower back for five, four, three, two, one. Ten, in and out to the left. Let's go. Ten, nine, eight, seven. You're almost there. Five, four, three, two, ten. Alternating Spider-Man. Let's go for ten. Nine, you're almost there. This is your last bit of hard work. Stay with me. You've got five, four, three, two, one. Oh my God. Oh, take it down and let's sit all the way back. Woo! Stretch those arms out. Just take your discs away. And if you want, you can move onto your mat. We're just going to open those knees nice and wide. Sit the butt all the way back. Big breath in and out. Let's walk those hands over to the right. Just placing that left hand on top. Just slowing that breath right down. I hope you enjoyed that one. I love to teach that in the studio. It's quite tough, quite the burner. All right, let's come back to centre. Walk the hands over to the left and that right hand on top. That's it. Slow that breath. Deep breath in through the nose. Out through the mouth. One more. Big breath in. And out. Coming all the way up. We're just going to finish with three cat cows. So shoulders stacked over wrists, hips stacked over knees. We're going to inhale, drop the belly, chest is open, tailbone out. 
Exhale, tuck the tailbone, lower back, mid back, upper back, press the mat away, look towards your belly button. Inhale, open. Exhale, tuck it under. Almost there, let's do one more. And press that mat away, really press the upper back towards the ceiling, hang the head. And let's come back to centre. I hope you guys enjoyed that session. We are done. Abs are cooked. Thank you so much. I will see you guys next time. Thank you. Bye.